this is Gaming on Link Skype, and today I have for you a Near Perfect with Proton. Uh, this game is called Fallen Angel. It's sort of like a Dark Souls, but in an isometric way, almost like a Hades. And all you have to do to get to run is you're going to go to Properties, Compatibility, you want to use 5.13-6, and you want to disable Steam Input because otherwise it it's just bad. It doesn't work right now on Linux. Alright, yes, I want to launch the game using Proton. So, this game uh, was kindly provided by the developer so that I could show it off to you and that it works on Linux. Um, I think it just came out with an update called like Ultimate Punishment, which is sort of like a mirror world mode. If you remember Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, um, how when you beat the game you get Master Mode, which would sort of like flip the game world, but also make it harder in a way. So that is you know, really an interesting update. And I think it's pretty cool that the developers are, you know, continuing to work on this. Um, you know, because, you know, some early access developers just give up and then, you know, you lose your money to an abandoned project. So this game is not in early access but they're updating it relatively frequently and if you'll give me a moment i accidentally opened it on the wrong screen part of mx linux is it uses the ar and r package to which is your primary uh, screen display and I believe my HDMI takes precedence um, over my uh, DP, DPI. I'm sorry, not DPI. Uh, D, DVI. So that is not. I'm sorry. Jeez. I am a little tired today. As you could probably tell, I meant display port. DPI. It's nice. All right, there we go. Fall Angel, it is opening. And I am just waiting for it to finish loading. There we go. And then it goes full screen. And I have a gamepad as recommended. So you know that I'm ready to rock and roll. So as you can see, game's running great, very smooth. I love the pixel art. Jumping is a little bit unique, considering this is like an isometric, you know, battler. Because jumping is generally more of a platformer thing. Like um, in Hades, you know, you didn't didn't have a jump. You just dashed, which was like a dodge. But here you've got a jump and a dodge. All right, ammo shard, interesting. I'm definitely going to say you're probably going to want to go borderless window because like most games on Linux, uh, full screen just does not seem to want to work all the time. And I don't really know why, but generally like a window or borderless window is always the way to go whenever you want to try and run a game at max FPS. This kind of really reminds me of like Hyper Light Drifter in a sense. You know, just the pixel art, um, the aesthetic, like that was really cool seeing that like giant fallen, you know, god creature. But uh, it definitely takes from more of a, a biblical lore considering we're playing as the one and only Lucifer. You know, God, a fallen angel, and oh, 
god of the underworld. Oh, I see. So this is like... Okay. So it's got a like a path tree that you can teleport between. That's neat. Uh, saving the game. Got it. Okay. All right. This has just been a taste of the game. I hope that you liked it. And of course, I really enjoy showing this off to you. If you want to see any more games in the future, please leave a comment in below telling me which game you want to see me cover. And as always, have an excellent day. And don't forget to like and subscribe.